Welcome to Local Edition. I'm Brad Pomerantz. We are joined by a new professor at Cal Poly Pomona. He is in the biology department. He specializes in... I study viruses, so viral diseases of the brain. And his name is Douglas Durant. And I want to speak with you about a program you've launched. It's known as Science on Tap. I'm yeah. kind of a you know, amateur scientist, so I think I would love this. Yeah, so that's perfect. That's exactly what it is. Science on Tap is a, an event that we hold quarterly, um, and we hold it at a local bar or brewery. Um, and it's an opportunity where we can bring scientists from Cali Pomona mm -hmm. out of the lab and bring them into a, an atmosphere that's relaxed at a bar or a brewery um, and, and tell about the science, the research that the professors do um, to, and present it to the community in a relaxed environment. How often do you do this? We do it on a quarterly basis. So this so just about, happens frequently? Yeah, basically. It's, tell us about <clears throat> some of the more recent presentations because I have to imagine that the professors are looking at topics of current interest. Yeah, that, that's definitely also one of our um, purposes that we do this is we want to take topics that are in the news and be able to go to the community and present factual data. Mm -hmm. So for instance, one, one thing that we have covered is uh, the Zika virus. That was uh, one of our first um, presentations that we had at Science, Science on Tap. And you, you, d you brought this program to Cal Poly, Pomona. Yes, I did. This is a program that's been run um, throughout the nation. There's other right. universities that do it. And I saw there was a need here so that we can actually um, interact more with the community here and let them know what actually is being done so at Cal Poly, Pomona. with regard to the Zika uh, discussion, there's a little fear surrounding it. We recently heard there were a couple cases in California, yeah. although we know transmission was not, uh, it did not occur here. Yes. It occurred elsewhere. What was the mood in the room when people were talking about Zika? Yeah, uh, there was a lot of interest. Um, and definitely this was before, um, it was uh, about before a couple of months before, right. before it got into Florida. Oh, I so see. So things might be different now. But yeah, there was a lot of interest. And like I said, it's a great opportunity that we can educate the community through this program and present them with factual, um, disseminate factual information about it. What other presentations have been made or will be made? Yeah, so we, we've covered um, some topics about <clears throat> um, shipping like with Mars Rover. Um, we've covered topics with how we prep those um, instruments to get into space and also how we look at um, life on Mars. Um, we, in the future, we wanna cover topics that, um, we wanna talk about the Milky Way project which is a, an interesting topic that um, one professor has started at Cal Poly Pomona where they take um, citizens and help them become scientists and help them um, evaluate data. And then also we want to look at- How could we be one of those citizens? Yeah, I want to <laughs> sign up. Yeah, that would be a great opportunity to come to Science on Tap and learn more about that opportunity. So how do we find out, Professor, when it is, where it is? Is there a cost? How does it work? Yeah, the Science on Tap is free for the public. Okay. They can come, it's a first come, first serve. Um, so it's free and open to everybody. Um, we generally, the information will be posted on the College of Science website okay. at Cal Poly Pomona, and also we try to disseminate that um, through the news as well. Have you um, done a presentation? I did. And yours was on? On the Zika virus. So I oh, was that was one. you? That was me, yeah. Okay, so <laughs> as long as we're on the topic, what should we do? What should we do for uh, Zika on virus? Zika. So there's, um, <clears throat> basically we just need to protect ourselves. Um, there is no, there's not been detected any Zika right. virus disseminated from mosquitoes in California. So far. So far. And hopefully it'll be that way. And I know that California has been very, the Department of Health has done a, a fantastic job of disseminating information right. and also preparing, um, making preparations. What's the that. website address? Do you know? I for do the know. science department? We'll put it on the screen. Don't yeah. worry. Yeah, that'd be His great. His name <laughs> is Dr. Douglas Durant. He is a professor of biology at Cal Poly Pomona. He's brought the Science on Tap program to the Inland Empire. I'm Brad Pomerantz. It's Local Edition.